everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Melanie and I do mainly daily food hauls. So if you like that sort of thing, please check out my channel. I have playlists for daily food hauls and weekly food hauls. As well as those, I do B&M hauls, which is a recent thing. I used to just add my hauls onto my daily food hauls, but now I'm doing them separately. And there's also a playlist as well if you want to look through the play playlist. There's not many in the playlist at the moment, but please feel free to check it out. So I've just been to B&M and I've come home and I've bought an assortment of different things so I thought I'd show you everything. So the last few times or probably the last handful of times I've been picking up cans of this Coconut Fusion 100. It's really really nice. I was in B&M yesterday and I spotted that they do a raspberry version and another version. I don't like raspberry but I might pick it up just to test it. And the other version, there will be a review on this on my blog, which is always linked down below, around the time this goes live on the channel, so please feel free to check that out. So I've got four cans of that. Then this is one of my favourite candles, and they're still doing it in B&M. So whilst they're still doing it every time I go, I'm going to pick one up. It's amazing. I also smelt this and fell in love, and I couldn't walk out without it. It was actually making my mouth water because it smells so amazing. Then I've decided to replace all my hangers in my wardrobe with these. Not only do they look really nice, but they're thinner, so hopefully it'll take a little less room up. I'm going to get 10 at a time until I've got as many as I need. I think I need between 20 and 30, probably more like 30. So they come in a variety of colours. They also had navy, pink and grey. And I was tempted by the grey, but I just went with black. It doesn't mean that I can't mix, mix them up and get some grey ones, I don't know. But I got the black ones. Then I got a new toilet brush because mine snapped the other day and I wanted to replace it anyway because I've just painted my bathroom and you will see in the colour if you've watched the other BMM hauls. So I got this to kind of match but the handle on it isn't very big so that's a little bit worrying. Then I got this to match the candle kind of. I have the spray version of this and it is winter one but it's half price so I'm going to put that in my downstairs toilet. Normally I have this in the downstairs toilet, not the latte version because that's the winter version. I just normally have the vanilla version that smells amazing for about five, six weeks. So I highly recommend them because they do smell amazing and they do last. Then I picked up the vanilla latte candle, which I've never had. I've got the aerosol version as I have with that as well. And they're pretty nice. So I picked the candle up because it smelled lovely. Then I got Comfort Intense, which is on offer for 80p. It's between £1 and one fifty in the supermarket, depending which one you go to. I normally pick up the cheaper brand that they do in B&M because they're all the same thing, just scented water. But I just picked this one up because it was only 10p more than the brand that B&M stock. This is the Fairy Liquid Washing Up Liquid that I use, the Fairy Platinum. This was about one forty nine. It's normally about £2, so I picked it up because there's about... A fifth left of the bottle that I've got and the bottle that I've got is a smaller size than this then I picked up Denta Sticks the two pack I think it was like 139 or something like that I'll just check the receipt it was 149 and they're normally a pound each so I thought that's good value then I have a few mixed products I'm, I'm testing them out slowly I don't want to buy a huge amount of them and they had this in two shades. This was the lighter one. I think it isn't the right shade for me because I do have pink toned skin and this is very yellow. But I thought I'd try it. I currently use the Roos powder, the setting powder, and it's probably the best powder I've ever had in my life. I have um, a lip product and an eye product and I'm slowly trying the products out and I bought them from ASOS. This is the first time I've seen NYX or NYX in B&M and I think it was 4 99 Let me just quickly check the receipt again. It was four ninety nine instead of eight pounds. I thought I'd work on top of foundation. I know it's a powder foundation, but I'm not going to use it as a foundation. But I do highly recommend the setting powder. They also had like it had a they, they had the sets that was bronzer, highlight, and blush, but it was the wrong shade for me. It was a medium, and I wanted a light, and I thought should I get it and then tan and then use it on tan skin and now I'm thinking maybe I should have done if it's still there next time I will pick it up but I doubt it'll be there then I picked up a very large bottle of Stella it is the 660ml bottle and then I've got this dog collar I got a one from Pets at Home ages ago and it's very similar to this but it's like a 
lilac-y purple shade and it does have spots on it and it's very similar it's got everything on identical but I think it was $7.99 and this was $2.99 but this was the only one in her size all the other ones there was quite some really nice ones nicer than this but they're all small and medium and she'll never fit in a medium she'll probably just about fit in a large so I got that because I thought at $2.99 it's an absolute bargain and that is absolutely everything that I got from B&M and it came to, if you can see that, $35.95 and if you want to look at the individual prices they are there. If you have any questions please leave them down below and I'll try and answer them and I'll be back very soon with another B&M haul. Thank you for watching, bye everyone.